Hello guys, welcome to the latest episode of Big Trip Northern Ireland, episode 4 of 5. And today I'm at Lisburn. This is on the line to Portadown and also on the main line for the uh, Enterprise to Dublin. So, uh, yeah, this line is for that one. Um, <clears throat> today you'll be seeing services from Northern Ireland Railways and also, um, well, you'll be seeing Translink under the sub-brands of Northern Ireland Railways and Enterprise. Both of them operate here. Uh, Enterprise don't stop here. Only on Sundays they stop here. So um, we will actually be seeing them pass through. We see, I think, two Enterprise services, but um, one is absolutely guaranteed. One isn't so much uh, because of timing, but you never know. I think we might be all right. Um, this station, very reminiscent with signage to that of Birmingham Moor Street and Leamington Spa and Malvern Link because of the fact that the station signage looks like this, quite old-fashioned, handcrafted, which is quite nice. Um, the station itself, very, very scenic. This part of the line is very nice, so I do look forward to seeing really what's uh, what pops up here. Obviously, you just saw a couple of you saw three thousand leave going to Porter Down from Banger, and you saw a 4,000 leave heading to Banger from Portadown. Those are the stopping services, usually the Portadown and Banger services. But also in between you'll get a couple of Enterprise trains passing through. Or if you go further along the line to somewhere like Portadown or Newry, you'll get them um, stopping as well. But we won't go into Newry because they pretty much rely on um, Enterprise trains only. So, anyway. Um, the other station I am filming today is Porter Down, so um, you'll probably that will be the video after this one anyway. But I'll remind you again at the end. Um, yeah, so if you do wish to check out any real-time updates on trips and posts, please do check out my Facebook group. The link is in the description. Uh, so without further ado, let's see what's on offer here, shall we? Let's get started here at Lisburn. I got there literally just in time for that. Passing through there was triple one two oh eight. Um, that was a, a passing enterprise service, and that was from Belfast Lanyon Place to Dublin Connolly. And that one almost caught me off because it came through quite early. But I presume Lanyon Place isn't that far away from here actually. So, um, but yeah, there that one goes. Okay, next train to arrive is going to be the uh, 1302 Northern Ireland Railway service from Bangor to Portadown, one of the class 3000. 3014 on this one. Service now after this calls at Moira, Lurgan and Portadown. See this one leave in a minute. Alright, the final now is going to be the 1302 Northern Ireland Railway service to Portadown. Actually also arriving is the 1308 Northern Ireland Railway service to Bangor from Portadown. Which is 3003.
So this one leaving in a minute. And the final is 3003 heading out on 1308 Northern Ireland Railway Service to Bangor from Portadown. Just a bit of a correction for you guys. Um, I've just realised that the um, Enterprise locos are actually the class 201s, not the class triple ones. I don't know, it must have been inaccurate information I read, but I didn't just make that up, I promise you. Um, but it's actually, from what I've read, is it's the class 201 that's locomotive, and then right next to, and behind it is a Mark III generator van, which I presume helps power it up more. And makes it more reliable um, but yeah I just realized it's class 201 <laughs> interesting that anyway so uh, question of the video I just wanted to point this one out so um, the actual um, carriages um, and do you, I do apologize if I pronounce this wrong but they're called the the Dietrich carriages um, I could pronounce that wrong, but I think they're German, possibly, or possibly Dutch, one of the two, but I think probably German. Um, and they're actually, the interiors and the design of the carriages are actually based off a train that operates in the UK. Can you name what uh, train carriages that uh, the, the Dietrich carriages, as you've seen in my video, the passing ones that went past uh, on this video, and also uh, the one at Lanyon Place. There's going to be another one passing through shortly as well. But the question is, um, what um, what train uh, are the carriages based off of? And just to assist you with the question, approaching now is going to be a passing enterprise service from Dublin Connolly to Belfast Lanyon Place. Formed of a class 201, got it now. And then the Mark III generator right next to it. The Mark III literally shoots out loads of uh, smoke as well from from the top. You can see it over there. Look at that. But take a good look at these carriages again and have a guess about what uh, train they're based off of that operates within the UK. That was a crazy tone. But there it goes through anyway. Anyway, I think the number was 201, uh, 208, but I could be wrong there. Uh, but there it goes anyway. It was 208 on the front, so I presume that's all it is. Just been doing a bit of research into the um, locomotive that operates on the Enterprise. Um, it turns out the class 201 is correct. It is the loco that works on it. 
um, and the Clash Triple One, it does exist. Um, you can tell I read it off Wikipedia probably, um, which I did. Um, but that's how I do most of my research. But um, I found out that the Clash Triple One actually used to operate, but then it got replaced by the 201 and three of the locos still actually remain but they actually only operate basically on ballasting duties over in Northern Ireland. Um, that's really their only purpose now because they used to be on the Enterprise but then they got replaced. Um, so the 201s are now the locos that operate on there. So um, that was my mistake, that's just my impression. They hadn't fully updated it so obviously I went with that. <laughs> um, but oh well, I found out the hard way anyway by actually reading it's the class 201 that operates there we go at least i'll know that for the future but yeah the class triple one doesn't operate in passenger use anymore from what i've seen um but yes um what else was i going to say yeah and that horn that they blew i think it was because people were over the yellow line so i think he was um warning to get back that was my presumption anyway Okay, approaching now is going to be the 1332 Northern Ireland Railway Service to Portadown from Bangor. 3020. Flanging a bit this one. And the part now is 3020 heading off to Portadown from Bangor. So off goes that one. Okay, and arriving now is the 1338 service, Northern Ireland Railway service from Portadown to Bangor. 3012. Just to let you know as well, this is the last train of this video, so we'll see this one go out in a minute. heading over to Bangor from Portadown. So as that one pulls out I'm going to finish the video from Lisburn here. So thank you all for watching this video from Lisburn. Do you know I really like the water tower over there. It's um, very rusty, very old, and I can't imagine it's used for very much, considering the, uh, the actual um, outsource has been basically tied up and blocked off, so I can't imagine it's used for much now. There's a ladder there, but what use? It's interesting to see it, though. Um, anyway, so... Uh, if you have liked what you've seen here at Lisburn, then please do like and subscribe. Please do leave any comments because I'll get back to them as when I can. And any recommendations are welcome. Please do leave us in the comments as well. Lovely station. Very, very scenic. Really good. My favourite one so far has probably been this one. Uh, because of the fact that it's had scenery. It's had passing trains, which we actually haven't had 
uh, in this video and obviously it was the Enterprise trains um, and actually we've had um, the station's quite old it's well looked after it's kept a very retro feel about it um, so I really like that especially with the water tower over there because I do think that that is a retro thing I don't uh, you know I can't see a diesel multiple unit like a 3000 stopping there and getting water because <laughs> it wouldn't need it um, but that is interesting it really is um, and the class triple one well no um, it needs to be fueled more than anything it doesn't need to have water it needs fuel um, but it is interesting to look at it and just uh, look at how cool this line actually is and this, air, this network is incredible I love it so much I really do and I really love the island railway um, it's so good so far and it's almost over actually for me filming because I've got one more station that's Porter Down um, where actually we're going to be seeing some Enterprise trains stopping and departing so that will be nice um, something different for each station really um, so that's really good so yeah, quite happy with Lisburn, lovely station, and uh, yeah, would recommend Northern Ireland as a whole really, it's incredible, um, but time to finish off now with Portadown, so see you on that video, thanks for watching this video from Lisburn, and I'll see you at Portadown, goodbye.